Hello everyone, Flight Express 1993 here. I will be doing a review for Mozilla Firefox 4 for Microsoft Windows. It's also compatible with Linux and Mac OS X. This is version 4.0.1. This right now, this is the latest version so far. the new interesting features that it has. The new features are CSS3 support and HTML5. And as you see they changed up the layout. It kind of looks more like the Opera web browser and, the, and some of the other Microsoft Windows programs. As you see you get to all your menus and stuff you go to or it says Firefox, the Firefox button. And if you press the Alt key, you get the sub menus, like the normal menus that you normally would have, like File, ed Edit, and Help, and etc. If you don't like the way the layout looks, you can always change it to the old way. See? Just go to where it says Menu Bar. This is another interesting thing. Say if I want to take Facebook, right? I just can make it as an app tab. Pretty neat. With certain websites, you can make them apps, like different tabs for other app locations on the web. And Windows Vista and Windows 7 users would have this layout. You can still use personal, which are themes, to customize the way Firefox looks. And you can get this layout too if you want it on Windows XP or Windows 2000. And there's going to be an upcoming version of Firefox, which is version 5, which is supposed to be released in two, like around June 21st, 2011. Yeah, it has some increased performance. The startup time for it to load, whenever you start up the browser, it takes a long while, like all versions of Firefox normally do. But normally it loads pretty quick. But YouTube sometimes glitches. And as you see here, so here's one of my videos I'm gonna show you. See how a Flash Player can handle. Yep, I got Flash Player 10.3. down. Well, it's going to be a little sluggish loading with my internet connection I'm not using a DSL connection. You still got the normal back and forward button. This is, you still got your bookmark bar. You can get, also go to your bookmarks right here which they added. You can still do web feed. You still the home button they moved over there. Pretty much this is not a bad browser. It's good as Chrome. You can also do full screen. Here got the normal button. And you got arrow support as well. If you're using Windows 7. And it does have some Windows 7 integration. And you still got private browsing. 
But they're supposed to be releasing a Firefox 5 soon, around June 21st. I don't know if it's true or not. It's like they, it's like they're trying to compete with Google Chrome, which is this web browser right here. There's another cool thing lot where you can do it Firefox. Put them in separate windows. I'm showing you some of the Windows 7 integration with Firefox. Pretty neat, hey? So, that was my little short demonstration of Firefox 4. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.